this is the bacon tower. I mean, I don't even know how you would get all of this in one bite. And now I'm making a complete mess, guys. Oh, shoot. I'm getting frustrated. <laughs> it's really good. We have stopped. We actually came into Countryside Mall to pick something up. And we came into the Bacon Street Diner. This is their menu. What she did tell me was that they are known for their breakfast tower, which is bacon and chicken waffle tower. Hand breaded chicken strip with your choice of cut bacon served on a stack of waffle layers with fresh strawberries and whipped cream topped with powdered sugar and a maple bacon cream puff. I just might have to get that. They do have some breakfast platters and they do serve breakfast all day. I don't know, I wasn't planning on getting breakfast, but that tower sounds so good. They have burgers, all day entrees, soup and salad, and some sandwiches. So let us order and we'll be right back. What are you gonna order, babe? French toast plate. Okay, and I think I'm gonna order that tower. So cute, they even give him his, his drink in a mason jar. I haven't seen that in a while. They used to do that at um, Ho Folks back in the day when I was a kid. So we just ordered, probably over ordered. So we will probably be leaving with some boxes. Now this one is I could have, should have ordered. Naming off a million things he should have ordered. We have to come back. When life gives you lemons, throw them away and get some bacon. <laughs> Love it. So oh, this is the bacon tower that I have received. Look at this thing. Look at the strawberries and the bacon. Mm. Oh, and that's one of those things they had at the front when we walked in that I wanted. Well, now I got one because it's on, it's, it's um, like a cream puff, but it's got maple and powdered sugar on it. And I think it has like a bacon flavoring on it. Mm. And then, we're eating this for dinner. <laughs> and then he Talk got about Carb City. He got the French toast French with toast. whipped cream and strawberries. And she said that they make this sure. fresh here. Um, it's not frozen or anything. Like it's made to order. Well, not the bread's not made to order, but she nothing's said it frozen. is nothing frozen. So, all right, we're gonna dig in. I don't even know how you would even eat this. Yeah, it looks like it's gonna collapse. So let's try eating it from this side first. Let's just chase the waffle itself. So. Oh, you're gonna dip it in the soup? I am, I'm just gonna try like the actual waffle. Look at that. Dipping it in high class style. Mm. Instead of pouring the syrup all over. And That's good. All right, so okay. now. Well, here we go. A waterfall of syrup. Let's get a better angle. Yeah, I think you're supposed to, I mean, I don't even know if there is a right way to eat this thing, but I mean, look at it. Comments. Now it's just dripping. Look What's at the that. proper way? Do you dip the waffle chicken into the syrup or do you pour the syrup on top of the waffle and the chicken? Yeah, let us know the proper way to eat, eat this. The chicken, it's good. It's got a crunch to it. It is really good. I mean, I don't even know how you would get all of this in one bite. But the chicken is definitely crunchy. All right, so here I got the strawberry, but I don't have the chicken. I don't understand how you would eat the chicken. I mean, I understand all the flavors go together, but I don't know how you would you get them. Up the chicken. Make it like a little shish kebab out of it. I think what you have to do is take the toothpick out of it. I think this is how you're really supposed to eat it. And now I'm making a complete mess, guys. A few minutes later. I'm getting frustrated. With this thing. <laughs> oh wait, oh here's God. some here's bacon, <laughs> strawberry. Here we go. Oh shoot. Oh my god. This is good. Now, here's the key. I really like this, it's good. 
but I wouldn't order it again just because it's messy and I can't figure out how to really eat this thing. But other than that, it's good to try it. And I definitely will be taking half of this home. Again, look how thick that piece of bread is. See, I'm gonna just cut off a little piece of it. And then I'm gonna just scoop a little bit of the cream, put a little bit of strawberries on it. Boom, look at that. Oh my God, yours is so much easier to eat than mine. And then dip it. It's really good. It's just the right balance of um, being crunchy, but not being too sweet. So the syrup doesn't really overpower the texture and flavor from the French toast. So I like this, it's pretty good. Would you order it again? I would. Look, I was right. This is about as much as I ate. Well, there's a little piece of French toast in there. I'm taking half of this home. So, here we have it, guys. We are leaving the Bacon Street Diner. It was really good. I would recommend this place again. Um, we weren't even planning on coming here. We actually just ran into the mall for one item. And then we passed this and thought it looked good, so we decided to stop. Do you have anything to say? It was really good. Wouldn't mind coming back. Good. All right. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And we will see you in our next destination.